This tutorial demonstrates how to create masks that hide features outside your area of interest. First, choose the layer on which to base the mask and make it the working layer. Use the selection tools to choose the features in your area of interest. Then choose Tools, Reports, Mask. Freehand masks can be created from an area layer and are extremely fast to create. Because the freehand mask hides everything outside the selected area, including labels, you may need to move some of the labels with a custom labels tool. For example, you can see that some of the labels are cut off slightly by the mask, so I'll move these to spots where they will be more visible. To remove a freehand mask, right click on it and choose Delete. You can also create layer masks. Layer masks may take longer to create, but do not obscure labels and can be created from point, line, or area layers. Again, choose Tools, Reports, Mask. This time I'll choose the Layer Mask option and click OK. New selection sets are created on the other layers to ensure that they are hidden. Maptitude prompts you to choose whether you first want to save the workspace without the new selection sets. In this case, I'm going to click No. Maptitude adds the mask layer to the map. If we restore the labels we moved for the freehand mask to their default location, you'll see that they are no longer obscured by the mask. And that wraps up this tutorial on creating masks in Maptitude.